October 22nd of this year, Spike 22 celebrates their 10-year anniversary, and they're showing no signs of stopping as they prepare to take it to the next level. Black Belt and coach Eli Monge. We're here at the uh, at Mescla. We have our, our first big fundraiser. Uh, we had a small car, uh, car wash fundraiser for our Spike 22 gym. Um, we're heading out to uh, Japan uh, to do our first uh, organized uh, uh, jiu-jitsu tournament. Uh, this is the first time Spike 22 has been uh, able to get a good program going. Um, we've been Spike 22 has been around for 10 years, but the jiu-jitsu program has been around for a year and a half now. We've had black belts like Joey Calvo, uh, black belts like Mike, brown belts like like Baby Joe, uh, Jake, uh, a lot of our, our, our purple belts like the Shocker, Bigler, um, that have been training, and Justin Benevente has been training. But this is the first time that we had a, 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 a team going out to Japan. So this is our first fundraiser. It's our first uh, food and, and, and uh, wine pairing. We're happy, excited about it. Uh, we want to do something different. Everybody else does the same thing. And uh, we decided to do a, a wine pairing uh, with food because it's different. And uh, as you see, there's it, so many people here and we're excited for the, the, the supporters. Now, if you want to donate and help us uh, get to Japan for October 13 and 14, please call me at 688-9301. Uh, and again, man, we're just trying to represent Guam uh, and, and, and show Guam, uh, show the world that Guam has a real good jiu-jitsu program. That's right. Spike 22's Jiu-Jitsu Club, along with several other Guam Jiu-Jitsu teams, are prepping to represent the island at the 2012 Asian Open Jiu-Jitsu Championship in Japan. Initially established as a mixed martial arts gym back in 2002, Spike 22 has expanded, creating an exceptional program a year and a half ago with a group of talented jiu-jitsu players. Brown belt and coach, Baby Joe Timinglo. It's a big opportunity for our gym. Uh, we have a lot of newcomers that, are, that we've been working with for the past, um, for about half of the year. And they come a long way and we really want to put them into international, international waters, you know what I mean? Um, Jiu-Jitsu credentials from myself, Baby Joe, we have Eli, Monge, Black Belt, and um, all kinds of uh, you know colored belts in our gym that we want to pass down our knowledge to our white belts and our blue belts that you know the sport is for everybody and they can do well as well and represent the island to the fullest. So this is actually one way of uh, you know showing our island that we can you know uh, we can fight and, and do well in, our, in the sport of jiu-jitsu. So, you know, we like to thank everybody that came out and support us and um, all the teams that's going to be heading out to jiu-jitsu, uh, to do jiu-jitsu in um, Japan. You know, we like to give them our support too because we're all going out there as Team Guam. So, you know, I'd like to thank the people of Guam for giving us our time, uh, their time to so show the support. The success of sport Brazilian jiu-jitsu has achieved such high levels that nowadays there are many schools spread out all over Asia. Japan lies in the center of this process, therefore the country was naturally selected to host the first ever Asian Championship of Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu from October 13th to 14th. Athletes from Guam, South Korea, Thailand, China, Philippines, Hong Kong, among other countries are being expected to participate. Spike 22 founder Melkor Manabusen is grateful for all the support that has made this journey possible. I want to thank everyone for coming out. Uh, this is um, our first major fundraiser for our Spike 22 Jiu Jitsu Club. We have never done this before. We're, we're a new team. We've been known as a mixed martial art, an MMA, wrestling gym. And uh, now I'm, I'm really I'm really happy to see the turnout for this. Our, our Jiu Jitsu Club has grown. Um, and you know, if anyone wants to support us and help us out, you know, send us team off island to our road to Japan. You can call 687-6905 or 688-9301. We'll appreciate any help. And thanks everyone for the support. We appreciate it. Much love. You can also help Spike 22's Jiu-Jitsu team by purchasing limited edition t-shirts for just $20 from any Spike 22 team member. Good luck to the team as they prepare for what incredible journey.